How we doing sports fans? Ghost Picks team Justin here. Absolute monster day tomorrow as we bring the pigskin back. No, I'm not talking about the Hall of Fame game. We're talking about the CFL, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, the Canadian Football League is back. Uh, they took the entire year off last year. As everyone knows, Canada was locked down and for the most part still is locked down. Um, but they are bringing back the CFL. Um, it is just as good to bet on as the NFL. Not to watch, but it is it is very entertaining, I will say that. Um, it's a little different. You have a different looking field. You have goalposts that are at the goal line rather than the back of the goal line. You have two 50 yard lines, there's three downs. Uh, everything about it is just a little bit different than what you would see watching your standard American football. However, with that being said, it's still football. It's still a blast to go ahead and um, throw some units down on. And I can't wait to bring that to you guys as part of the Ghost Picks family. Um, I know some of you guys might be skeptical or you might not be into it right away. Um, guys, this is such a great thing to get into, especially while the NFL is just going through training camp preseason. These are real games that matter from the get-go for these guys, and, and they play it that way. Um, I look at it as kind of like you're betting on college football where it's, you know, some of the games might be lopsided, but you just have to find the right angles and um, get the lines to where you want them in certain ways. And that's what we're going to do here for the CFL. Um, highly encourage you guys. It's a fun season. Um, and we are going to do an absolute bang and blow up, um, bang and deal to start off the CFL. Um, as you guys know, uh, MLB has been absolutely dominant. Um, we have just been crushing MLB, and I want to give you guys MLB and CFL football for the heck of a deal. Um, you can either hop on the season, and you can do um, the rest of the MLB season and the entire CFL season for $500, get you both sports all the way till every single game has been played, or you can just try out an MLB month, and you will get a CFL month attached to that MLB month, and you can go and hop on those plays that way as well. Um, either way you guys want to do it, I'm just telling you, I would highly encourage you guys try it out. Obviously, you guys can do your $29.99 um, All Sports Access Day, and you will get CFL plays with that as well. Um, but for the longevity of it and the long-term things, guys, I highly recommend you hop on it. We have games coming tomorrow, Friday, Saturday. It's going to be a blast. Um, we're starting off with the Tiger Cats take on the Blue Bombers um, in Thursday Night Football to put this thing all off. You can watch it on YouTube TV. If you're from Canada, obviously, it's probably going to be on TSN. Um, it's it's really going to be a good time. Um, I can't encourage you guys enough to hop on. Um, even if you just want to do a day package, that's fine too. But I'm telling you right now, this deal is not going to be out there for that long. Um, once you guys see how we're going to be rolling in CFL action, you're going to be bummed that you missed out on it. And I'm, I'm just telling you right now, I would hop on it now. Um, get into what we had at the MLB today. Um, we had a good, we had a decent day. We um, our free play is still out there. Uh, it's only in the bottom of the third right now. I'm still watching that one closely. Uh, we started off with an absolute heartbreaker. We took the Reds on the run line, taking on the Twins. Um, I'm gonna jump forward right away to the um, top of the eighth, six to one, and the Reds bullpen just fell apart. Um, twins ended up coming back. They lost five to six, but they ruined our run line. I'm not gonna be. I'm not gonna be beating around the bush here that, that sucked that was a that was a tough tough loss um we ended up firing up a second play toronto blue jays run line uh versus the cleveland indians and again we're gonna jump right into the top of the eighth uh it was eight to nothing and they put in five runs and i'm sitting here like there's no way this is gonna happen again both bullpens just absolutely worthless tonight uh i mean it was bad uh and then to make things worse uh they put on a hit at a home run um in the top of the ninth to make it six to eight and i'm my worst nightmares becoming a reality um thankfully we could um win that game and they did no more damage six to eight uh it was just a really really tough 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 um eighth inning and beyond to watch for team justin uh but like i said we won one and one both five unit plays um, pretty much got a wash on the day. Uh, 
I mean, it could have been a monster day. I, I you know I hate when I say that, but it, man, I'm just that was a, that was a tough beat, and I really I had a pit in my stomach watching that Blue Jays game. It was rough, um, but I don't know. Uh, looking at our free play, I really do. I think that that one's gonna come through. Still looking at uh, the Giants on the run line. Um, tomorrow's free play though, Houston Astros. They're coming off a very very tough series versus the the Dodgers. However, with that being said, they go back home. They get the Minnesota Twins. The Twins I was just telling you about who looked like they weren't even a baseball team until the top of the eighth. Um, I have more faith in Houston's bullpen than that. Um, they have a rookie on the mound. His name's Jax. I really don't know much about him. I know he has a high ERA. It's 6.41. Uh, Valdez is a very, very good pitcher. Uh, I'm just looking for value here. And even on the, even on the run line, um, they're still going to be minus 135. It's it's uh, getting creeping up to that spot where it's too much juice for me. But for a free play, uh, guys, Houston is going to work it tomorrow. Um, I don't even care what happens with them in their Dodgers game tonight. They took one from the Dodgers already. If they lose, I like the play even more, as crazy as that sounds. You always want a team to bounce back. After coming off a tough loss to a good team, uh, taking on a mediocre team that's packed in them for the season, um, but if they win, then they're just a, a team that's streaking and they're going to keep that thing going versus the Twins. Either way you look at it, Twins are not going to win tomorrow. Uh, I look for Houston to cover. Take Houston Astros run line um, as a free play. Uh, good luck. God bless. Grind on and let's go.